Hey guys, welcome back to Nia Nirvana. Today's Pursuit to Paradise takes us to Encore Resort at Reunion in Kissimmee, Florida, a resort-style community of single-family vacation homes within 10 minutes of Disney World and other Orlando attractions. The community features its own water park, dining, and concierge services as well. So here is the house that we booked, which features 11 bedrooms, 10 bathrooms, three half baths, a kitchen, living and dining area, a movie theater, and a private pool and large backyard. It fits a max of 22 guests. As you can see, as soon as you enter, it's a very nice open concept layout. First off, we have the living area. So we spent Christmas here, so of course we had to bring our own mini Christmas tree and decorations <laughs> so that we could put all our gifts under it. The living area was spacious and featured a large sofa and TV. Next up we have the kitchen which was also spacious and featured an oversized island, two refrigerators, a stove top, two dishwashers and two ovens, both of which actually stopped working during our Christmas dinner prep. <sighs> I'll get back to that. <laughs> they did also provide eating and cooking utensils, plates, glassware and pots and pans but it was definitely lacking especially because the home caters to 22 guests. We ended up having to go to Walmart for additional items. The pantry was a great size though and as you can see my family members thought we were moving in forever and OD'd on the groceries. <laughs> Here we have a nice bar and storage area and next up is the dining area. So I absolutely love these lights and the space was definitely large enough for all of us. And then just outside the sliding doors is the backyard which features a private pool and jacuzzi. So definitely a great size and absolutely one of my favorite parts of the house. And if you're enjoying the video so far, please be sure to hit that like and subscribe button. Thank you. <laughs> there is also a small patio with an additional dining area and a grill. I should mention it's an additional charge to use it and you'll have to purchase a propane cylinder. And then right next to it is a half bathroom. Of course, we made use of the grill and had a barbecue and pool day, and we even wore family reunion t-shirts that we got printed. We're extra, I know. <laughs> and then as you can see, they also added a baby gate for the pool. Next up, we have one of the master bedrooms featuring a king bed, TV, closet, and ensuite bathroom. The bathroom features double sinks, a shower, a soaking tub, and water closet. Down the hall, we have another bedroom featuring a king bed, TV, closet, and ensuite bathroom again. Unfortunately, majority of the TVs didn't work in the bedrooms. So like I said, the room also features an ensuite bathroom and then just across and at the entrance of the house is a powder room and then a laundry room with a washer, dryer, iron and ironing board as well as additional pool towels. And to be honest, majority of the rooms did look the same so I won't bore you guys with all but here are two other suites downstairs that also feature closets and ensuite bathrooms. And before we head upstairs, as you can see, our large family of 22 fit perfectly in the space and definitely made it feel like home. We had pajama night, secret Santa gift exchange, Christmas dinner, and lots of jokes and fun. <laughs> oh, and let's not forget the Christmas carols. <laughs> Yeah. 
now accepting bookings guys <laughs> link in bio <laughs> all right let's go upstairs so here we have the entertaining space in the house featuring a card table and mini bar and then just to the left we have a pool table additional seating and another tv Just off the game room is an oversized balcony overlooking the backyard. As you can see, it's pretty big and it actually connects to two of the bedrooms. And then just across there is the community water park that I mentioned earlier. Unfortunately, this house didn't include access. So off the balcony, we have another master bedroom. Please ignore the bed. It was very, very hard trying to capture these videos with 21 other people running around. <laughs> Here we also have a king bed, TV, closet, and ensuite bathroom with a shower and water closet. And of course, a special shout out to Auntie Pauline and Claude for helping me to clean up downstairs for this video. <laughs> Love y'all. And then also connected to the balcony is this bedroom, which is pretty similar to the one just now, but a smaller version and the bathroom doesn't have a water closet. Just beside, we have another bedroom featuring two beds and an ensuite bathroom. And then directly beside it is another identical room. Down the hall and closest to the movie theater is another smaller suite featuring a bathtub in the ensuite bathroom. And then lastly, there are two kids bedrooms which are themed. So the first one as you can see here is a Minions room. It features double bunk beds and a closet. And the second one is a Marvel theme and has two beds as well and a closet. So both of the kids' bedrooms actually share a bathroom. It oddly enough features a shower though instead of a tub. Insert someone's head, one, two, three. <laughs> and then my favorite feature of the house, the movie theater. So as you can see, it's definitely a great size and we enjoy movie nights in here. So I thought I'd also show you guys the two car garage and driveway as street parking actually isn't allowed here. So there's definitely enough room but just something to consider. And that's a wrap. <laughs> Bye family. And now for my overall rating. First up, price for value 3 out of 5. So we booked through Airbnb and the rate at the time was $1,175 per night for a max of 22 guests. However, with the cleaning fee, service fee, occupancy taxes, and other fees, it went to $1,753 per night. There was also a four-night minimum during the Christmas dates, so our total in all was $7,014.93. So while that might sound like a lot, it was all of 11 bedrooms, 10 bathrooms, included a private pool, as I said, and a movie theater. But at the same time, many of those amenities did come at an extra charge. So um, pool heating was extra, which is understandable. But I thought that an extra charge just to use the grill, even though we're already buying the gas cylinder, was a bit much. Also, basic things like TVs didn't work in most of the bedrooms, which was very annoying. And let's not forget the two ovens that broke during Christmas dinner prep. I repeat, during Christmas dinner <laughs> 
prep. We ended up with an entire ham that wasn't even cooked properly. Disappointing to say the least. So with half of the appliances and electronics out of service, I think I'm actually going to lower the score to 2.5 because I'm getting annoyed just thinking about it. Location, 4 out of 5. So like I mentioned, this home is in Encore Resort at Reunion, which is in Kissimmee, Florida. It's actually a great location and literally only 10 minutes away from Disney World and about 30 minutes from Universal Studios and SeaWorld. So definitely the perfect place for family vacations. Food and Chef, 1 out of 5. So two words, no ovens. <laughs> Next up, design and cleanliness, four out of five. So we were overall pleased with the condition of the home prior to arrival, as daily housekeeping is not included. We did definitely love the open layout and thought everything flowed very well. And lastly, service and communication, four out of five. So responses were quick from the host and they did try to solve the issues that we had. So they did send someone the next day to try and repair the ovens, but it wasn't fixed even when we checked out two days later as I think it needed a part. Since we could only use the grill, they did offer to reimburse us for the cylinder for the grill. So that was definitely appreciated, but it was still very disappointing nonetheless, especially because it was our Christmas dinner. And the overall score, 15.5 out of 25. Would I go back? Mm, I don't think so. <laughs> Definitely a first on the channel. I would go back to Encore Resort though and just try out another home. If you like this video, don't forget to leave a comment, like, and subscribe. If you loved it, please share and turn on your post notifications. On to the next pursuit. Thank you so much for watching.